there, I'm Bianca Pitts from Creative Marketing Mom. I have a really cool, very quick um, video, but it is going to come with a disclaimer first. So I'm going to show you in just a few clicks how to download a Wistia video um, just from a site. Now, there are a ton of good reasons that you would need to do this. Uh, one of them is I forgot the password. <laughs> to an old account. And so on one of my websites, I've got a video sitting there and I can't get to it. So that's what I'm using it for. It took me a while to figure it out. Uh, please don't use it for nefarious purposes. Um, but you know, I'm sure all of you are ethical entrepreneurs like myself. So we're going to right click all we have to do. So I'm on just the Wistia site using their video as obviously their video uses their software. So all you have to do is right click on the video and most of the time you'll see the copy link and thumbnail depending on the settings uh, and whoever the owner is it does sometimes it doesn't. So I'll show you the first way which is the easiest. This is the easiest way. You just open a new tab and then you paste that code that I just had you find. And then right here you'll see this HTTPS Wistia.com slash all of this. After this equal sign, okay, copy that little code right there. That is the ID for the video. So all you have to do is copy that. Pretty neat, huh? So right click or copy however you want to do it. Um, we'll copy this. And then, so we'll just do it here. It's going to be fast uh, Wistia.com slash embed slash, slash iframe. Then we're going to add one last slash and we will paste that short little ID that we had and press enter. Bada bam, bada boom. Neat, huh? You'll see that we have an, you have an entire tab just for this video. The problem is you still can't download it from here, right? You right click, it won't let you. But what you can do is go back and we're going to view the the code that we had typed up there it's called the source code so we're going to type up here and just edit the url so that we can see that big old thing of code again so we're going to go to view biw source and then a colon and hit enter and now we're going to get a bajillion lines of code now that we've got our view source up we're going to do if you're on Mac, it's Command F. If you're on uh, PC, it's Control F. And then this little box will show up. It's just the find box, and we're gonna type in dot bin because dot bin must be what they use for their hosting or something. Uh, and so what you'll see is this dot bin will show up, and there's nine options, and you're gonna go through. And you'll see all of these and we'll pick the one that we need. Now that we've typed in the dot bin, what comes up is another URL. So we're just going to grab this. We're just going to copy, we'll click it, we'll highlight it. Ooh, it went too far. We'll start at the HTTPS and end at that number. We're going to click copy. We're going to put it up here and we're going to hit enter. And then ba-bam! Now it's going to show you something you can download. Pretty sweet, huh? Now you can click the little dots and download it. So that is it. It is crazy easy, super handy, um, and I will see you guys in the next video.